Good <laughs> treat here on your Feel Good Breakfast show this morning. We have Richard Sturton in the house. Ladies and gents, a big round of applause, please. Richard, no. Yes, yes, yes. Richard, Richard. Well, man, look, he burst onto the scene uh, at the age of 22 after winning The Voice South Africa. Ooh. Season one of it. Come you on since now. He's gone on to do so well, releasing your debut album, shooting up to the charts. Wow. Peaking at number one wow. at that, and here yeah. you are today joining us again. Welcome. Thank you the so much for having me. The voice above all voices, Richard. Thank it you. is so good to have you on the show. Listen, what has the experience been like for you so far? I mean, you are season one winner, yeah. Yeah. and here you're sitting. We've been fortunate enough to have you on the couch a few times, yeah. but you've had a quite it a journey. It is a roller coaster. I'm not yeah. going to lie to you. I woke up in that bedroom the next day at the hotel <laughs> after winning it, and I just. I really couldn't believe it. And yeah. then obviously after that, I'd never really played a lot of live music. I kind of just sang in my bathroom. Wow. And I was like, this is dope. The acoustics are great. But <laughs> actually going out and touring and playing shows where people actually pay money to come and watch you, yeah. Yeah. it was a very surreal thing. So basically toured for a couple of years. And then I kind of wanted to release some more music and kind of find out exactly who I am as an artist and start yeah. really working at that. Because obviously once you do a TV show, you have like three weeks to record an album. Yeah. yeah. So it was just a case of looking introspectively and that's what this whole new EP is about, Naked, yeah. and just being honest and real about sort of who I am and where I am. Yeah. Yeah. And, you know, uh, we all sound good in the bathroom, but I'm so <laughs> happy that yours worked out for the best, you know, because I think a lot of people sang in the bathroom and then went for auditions and were well, given very hard. I grew up singing in the bathroom. My dad would say, OK, go back and practice, go back yeah. and practice. So well, it wasn't always good. Uh, the practice has, has, has clearly worked out. But now, clearly, you also Hello. spend a lot of time What is gymming. happening? What That's is happening? There's possibly the, the, the motivation behind your latest EP, Shit. Naked, right? Yeah. Yes, no? That yeah. You've got well, a body like this, so you can be naked, or what? Um, it was combat, that wasn't <laughs> really, that was the whole concept. But I kind of, as I said, with that, like, looking at respectively and working out, I kind of wanted to go in a bit of a cleanse. Mm. Because yeah. I was getting into a bit of a toxic spiral of just sort of self-destruction, you know, wow. you, you, you're out all the time. It's quite a, quite a heavy lifestyle and I kind of wanted to take a step back. I stopped drinking alcohol completely, mm. started eating clean, started training and just to give me some balance and sort of yeah. clarity mm. in my mind. That's awesome. Yeah, so yeah. that's what I it was think, about. I think we, and we've all heard about that rock star lifestyle and the fact yeah. that you've decided to go a very healthy route, you mm. know. Um, it's wonderful and the proof is in the pudding. You look amazing. <laughs> yeah. Can Thank you just you. give a hand, those hands there? Hello, yeah. one, two, three, four, five, six. I love Thank them. You. None. All right. So, um, <laughs> What's it got to do with me? What are you have, <laughs> I love you. OK, so you've also shared lineups with the likes of the Parlotones, Corin Zoid, Franca Van Kogh. Who are you itching to collaborate with next? You, yeah, that's a big call, eh? Mm. Um, put it out there. Just put it out there. Yo, yeah, I don't know. Overseas, there's some wild dudes. I mean, there's a guy called Lewis Capaldi. Yeah. I don't know if you've ever heard of him. He's a new dude. He's 22, but like super down to earth, which Next is the most refreshing thing for me. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Like he literally like filmed himself singing his new single in his bathroom in a hotel what? without a shirt on. And he's like, he's just an average dude. And he's like, yeah. I want to be taken seriously as a musician. Like yeah. he's yeah, yeah, yeah. just a joker, chill dude. I'd love to collaborate with a guy like that. Ed Sheeran, yeah. obviously. Yeah. Uh, oh, yes. That locally, I want to do a track with Dan Pedlansky because he's a Ooh, yes. monster guitarist, so it'd be cool. But, yeah, whatever. Yeah. If anybody's keen, let me know. Uh, at the camera. Let him know. <laughs> Well, it's yeah. Richard Sturton. He's here all throughout the morning here on your Feel Good Breakfast show. We'll be chatting a little bit with you as well, a little bit later, finding out what your uh, plans are, because now you obviously are independent and yeah. all of that, so people are looking and itching to find out what's next for you. Let us know what you think. Any questions for him? Hashtag Espresso Show.